Hello and welcome to Talk the Walk. Today we are walking the Red Squirrel Trail from Shanklin to Roxall. The Red Squirrel Trail consists of 32 miles of walking and cycling routes where old railway lines once lay and takes you through the heart of the Isle of Wight's beautiful countryside. The trail takes in estuaries, woodland, farmland, downland and a stretch of the island's fantastic coastline. This two and a quarter mile section of the railway line we are walking today opened in September 1866 and closed in April 1966, missing its centenary by a few months. There used to be a 55 and a half mile network of railway lines on the Isle of Wight and were opened by several companies between 1862 and 1901 and were grouped into larger companies in the 1920s. In 1923, the island's railways became known as Southern Railway. Most of them were permanently closed between 1952 and 1966 and the Island Line and the Isle of Wight Steam Railway are the only routes still open today. So we are just over halfway through our walk now and we've had quite a mixed bag of weather. We've had sunshine, wind, rain, we've seen quite a few different species of bird though which has been nice and we're just going to find a nice spot to eat our lunch. With lunch completed we continue our walk to Roxall. With so many bridges along this route it's not hard to see how it was once a railway line. We are now at St John's Church, which dates from 1875 to 1877 by the architect T.R. Saunders, with the tower being added in 1911. Excavation from the nearby Ventnor Railway Tunnel provided the stone as the building material. This was in order to keep costs down, but it has since proved to be of poor quality as the building is in constant need of refacing. 